Well, welcome to our sale uh, of furniture this November. And this month's feature is going to be on this rather attractive example of the Polyphon clock. The clock is self-explanatory, but the key with this, the thing that sets it apart, is it's a very early musical technology. Uh, dating to the end of the 19th century, between about 1885 and 1900, this is when the Polyphon clock was in the foremost of its uh, popularity. So, from the top we have a very nice clean pediment in a walnut case, and this rather attractive enamel Roman numeral dial. Um, so as a clock, it's decorative, it looks nice in the home, that's one part of its charm. But setting this well above the rest is the fact that down beneath we have, we open the door and we have the early precursor to a gramophone or a compact disc player that we have today. And uh, it's called an Orpheus Polyphon and it's a musical player and it plays these enormous discs and it sits just inside uh, like so and um, it really is, uh, follows on from your cylinder musical boxes that were made by the likes of Nicole Frere in France and were very popular and put in cigarette boxes as well as, a, as, well as larger 9, 10, 12 tune musical boxes. Then this followed the Polyphon and it only was in uh, production for about 20 years because soon after this uh, we came across the gramophone uh, with the large horns made by the likes of HMV. Um, so it has, um, it's relatively rare. Uh, we don't see many, especially in this condition. This one is estimated at three to four thousand pounds. And uh, we obviously hope it'll go on to make more. But um, as an early technology, it really is a very special piece of musical furniture. So I hope you enjoy watching this sell and uh, we'll see how it goes.